with a GMA exclusive, Christina El Musa, the star of HGTV's Flip or Flop, is speaking out for the first time on live TV since she and her husband announced their split. Her story is featured on the cover of People magazine, and we'll speak with Christina in a moment. But first, ABC's Mars Gavacampo has the latest. They're the couple who transformed the neighborhood eyesore. Oh my God, I'm so out of here. Into a gem. This is what's gonna sell the house. As the stars of HGTV's hit show, Flip or Flop, no mess is too big for Tarek and Christina El Musa. The bigger the disaster, the better the makeover. But off screen, a different story. The couple announcing in December they were calling it quits after seven years of marriage and two children, Taylor and Brayden. We have a crazy busy life. We love flipping houses, but but nothing compares to spending time with our family. Last May, police responded to the couple's home after receiving a call of a possibly suicidal man with a gun. But the El Musas tell ABC News there was no violence and no charges were filed. The latest in several public battles over the past few years. In 2013, Tarek was diagnosed with thyroid cancer and had his thyroid removed. The couple also reportedly struggling with infertility. And they face complaints surrounding their Success Path Education real estate investment workshops. I stand by our product. It's our tools. It's our system. It's what Tarek and I do. Now, the El Musas say they are committed to co-parenting and finishing show production as scheduled, though many wonder what the future of one of HGTV's biggest hits will look like. For Good Morning America, Mara Esquivel-Campo, ABC News, New York. And we are happy to welcome Christina to the show this morning. Woo! Good morning. Hey. And, um... You, you've gone through you've gone through so much over the past year all in the public eye so how have you been been holding up I mean honestly despite everything I'm doing really 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 good thank you and, and you've been going through so much in such a short period of time Terry's cancer your infertility how have you how have you both been able to kind of hold it together you know um, Tark and I met 10 years ago at work and we went through a market crash um, like you said we went through cancer infertility. Um, you know, and now we're going through a very public divorce, mm -hmm. but, you know, despite everything, um, you know, our primary focus is and always will be our kids and, you know, we continue to work together and there's a lot of, you know, false stories and a lot of hype, but, you know, in the end we're just normal, nice people who just, you know, want to be the best parents and, you know, co-workers that we can be. And I know you've posted a, quite a bit of pictures with, with your kids, you, bo you both together with your kids. So how is the co-parenting working out for you? It's honestly going really good. You know, our kids are, are amazing. Our son, he's 18 months. He's like literally the happiest kid on the planet. I mean, he's just like always in a good mood. And, and Taylor, she's six and she's just, she's just awesome. Um, she actually just won an award at school for being joyful. You know, so it just shows that like our kids are transitioning mm -hmm. well. You know, Tark and I are friends and we have a lot of support from our family. And and, you know, it's it, despite everything, you know, that, that, you know, the articles show. It's, so, they, so the kids are coping well. Yes, the kids are doing great, mm -hmm. really great. Now, now fans, the fans of the show, which I'm a, I'm a big fan of the show, and I watch it on Marathon, and, and fans of the show are wondering what's going to happen with the show. We hear that the show's going to continue. There may be a spinoff. Right. What's going on with that? So currently, you know, season six is on air, and Tark and I are filming season seven of Flip or Flop. Um, we film together three, four days a week, and... It's, you know, we have a great crew. We have so much fun on set mm -hmm. and we, you know, we look forward to continuing the show. So it, so it, but it's not, it's not strange or unusual to work with, with your spouse going Honestly, through all like Tark and I, you know, we met at work. So mm -hmm. we worked together before we ever started dating and, and it's just, it's our, it's our normal. Um, we also run a seminar company together, Success Path. And every five weeks we go to Vegas together. We're on stage and we have a great time and, you know, we'll, we'll always be working together. So those seminars are going to continue. So that, that's all going to stay the same yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. We have a seminar um, Friday in Newport Beach. And, and you've also been working on a book. And I know a lot of times when you work on a book, it, it kind of opens you up and you have to re relive some things. And, right. and you learn some things from your past experience that you didn't realize you right. learned. You're working on a book now. Right. Is there anything that has stood out that you've, you've learned? So I'm in the very early stages. Um, I'm actually like going to get more in depth in the next couple weeks. Um, I'm so excited. It's going to be just basically about all the lessons that I've learned along the way. And everyone has, you know, troubles. And, you know, a lot of people go through divorces and so 
situation. So um, I just want to, you know, tie it back to the things I've gone through and like what's really helped me cope. Well, it doesn't seem like you two have shied away from being out in the public with it, with your seminars and all those things. How has the reaction been from your fans outside of whatever someone may meet, read right. in the media? How has the reaction of the fans it's been? been? Really positive. I mean, I get so many nice messages from people that have gone through similar situations, and like just the positive outreach has just, you know, it's, it's really, it's really helped me get through this. Well, you know, we wish you luck, and thank you for coming. Thank you. Thank thank you, you for so coming. Really appreciate it. Thank you. And People Magazine, it hits newsstands Friday, and you can see more of Christina on the People Entertainment Weekly Network. And Christina, thank you again. And coming.